are sailing through many rough waters. Temptations on every hand, and if you feel you can make it through, call on me. I'll be there. I'll be praying with you on my knees in prayer. I'll be standing in the gap for you. Call on me. I'll be there. I'll be praying with you on my. Hey YouTube! Hey! How are you doing? Welcome back to my YouTube channel! My name is Petronella and if you are new here, let's do the subscribing thing, okay? Like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss any content that I'll be posting. So I know, I know it's been a minute. I know guys and I don't know what is happening to my light. Okay, where are you? Where can I be seen better? all right i hope you can see me but it's been a minute um things have been hectic mostly i think i wanted to post stuff on my youtube channel but then like i was like i don't want to come here and be like i'm okay i'm cool i'm happy and everything is going on well when i know deep down my heart that my heart is literally breaking like i'm hurting a lot it's just been a hectic time you know i lost my friend and you know it's just been a lot it's just been a lot so um, yeah but i'm so glad that today that i was like i don't want to do this but let me do this uh today i'm going to an event called the girls conference where there'll be i think mostly it's about relationship talks about just a group of girls hanging out and i am going to be singing there so if you don't know what i do uh don't mind the noise like i'm standing somewhere somewhere yeah yeah where my mom is getting something so yeah so uh let me just tell you a little bit about what i do so petty is a musician a songwriter i teach also songwriting classes and i sing at people's events besides like recording my own stuff i sing at events uh, motivational events mostly book launches motivational events and stuff like that and i um, i record like i think i've mentioned that i'm a recording artist artist as well as um i write song i write songs for people so if you need some writing class if you need to uh, to learn how to be a songwriter my next class is in september and if you want me to write you a song you can always like say hi Betty, i want a song or if you want me to come and sing probably at your wedding at your event you can as well just um inbox message me on social media and stuff I also have hold your hand which is my baby where we encourage girls and just say yeah we can do this we can do this let's do this and besides that i have a podcast i think you've already like listened to my podcast so yeah um, and i also host events all right so i think that's me now i'm gonna be taking you along with me and i hope i'll be able to capture everything and just like say okay this is what we're doing today and stuff so enjoy my vlog I'll be praying with you on my knees in prayer. I'll be standing in the gap for you. The mark of the age is brotherly kindness and perfect love shall come down. That's what it will take to change dimensions. So let's agree. On my knees in prayer, 
I'll be standing in the gap for you. Call on me, I'll be there. I'll be praying with you on my knees in prayer. I'll be standing in the gap for you. still there with me and i hope you have enjoyed like the first part of the video yesterday i was just like to god god i don't want to go i just don't want to go anymore and then you know something inside of me was like i don't want to say something inside of me but i guess it was just me i was just like ah, but i've made a promise i should keep my promise and i should go so i i actually went uh, i was at the girls conference and i performed my song pounding Geori. now that i have performed and i've seen like the videos of my performance and someone said to me like because i posted it on my whatsapp and one of my friends commented ah oh, Betty, where did you get the confidence and you know what when my friend actually said that, I actually noticed it. I was like, I'm actually like improving, improving as far as performance wise. I can look back at when I did the I Understand event this year, like the beginning to now, I can see like the improvement. And then I was just like, yeah, so this is it. Just to take you back a little bit, I was telling some, like, I always tell people that one of my dreams um, is to perform in this venue called the City Sports Center where um, we usually attend conferences and stuff and I remember like the f one, like my experience is the first time I got there I think one of my first times in there or second time I'm no longer sure and I just felt it like you know one day you're gonna be here you're gonna be performing here your own show so when I now looked at that performance, I was like, you know what? I'm glad I showed up. You know, I'm so happy and I'm so thankful to God that I showed up because this is the preparation. If I don't prepare, like performance wise, do not also, but when I now get the opportunity, like get a bigger crowd or at a large, um, uh, an opportunity then I start performing there no because like practice makes perfect and I guess this was like the perfect uh, practice for me and I'm just like I was just like so this is it it's happening like God is actually like preparing me for that moment yo, yo, you're gonna perform in this city sports and I'm not sure how many people can get in there I have to check with check for you guys but I was like, okay, so this is it. This is happening. And I have to keep going. I have to keep singing and doing this. Even if it means I'm doing it for five people, for ten people, it will, it's practice. You know, it's, that is the practice. And it's better to, I, I was just writing something in my notes. I was like, it's better to bleed in practice. But what, what, the battle. The, the, the statement didn't come through but I just hope you get what I'm saying just show up you know I just wanted to come here and say you know what just show up God is like preparing you even if it means it's one person it's two people God is preparing you for that big thing and if you don't practice you don't practice and if you don't practice you will never like be good at what you want to achieve or what you your what you're fighting for so practice practice you know go through the training so that the battle will be easier and lastly but not least um i also wanted to point out something i think people they see me like doing uh singing and stuff at these events if you follow me on social media you know but also i think 
people they don't also know um that some of the times i have to say no to a lot of things which brings me to my last point which is like i am a christian and there are th places that i don't perform there are things that i just don't do there are clothes that i don't wear and stuff like that based on what i believe so is i just wanted to say that remember that value remember your because sometimes i think you're just like maybe i've missed an opportunity or uh the money at all and if you're actually like getting paid you're like ah oh, the money is gone like i've missed it because i said i didn't want to perform it like god will provide you know god will provide if you want if you just stick to your principles for me i'm just like there are places usually i perform i perform at motivational events at uh book launches as well as um weddings and stuff like that there are places that i just don't perform especially if i know like the place it can get eating mostly with you know some non-christian activities so yeah that's what i wanted to say i just wanted to say like put value on yourself and don't worry like god will provide where you lack. god will provide be like ah no it's okay god will provide and you open doors in your land as well in that land that you are like fighting for and you are sticking to sticking to yes so yeah that's what i wanted to to say to be like i think you are not a true musician like a gospel musician if you haven't said no to certain um places like performances despite like even if it means like more money and stuff but if you feel like this is not a place that i want help to perform I think that's where you really prove your Christianity, like your who you are as um, a Christian. So that's what I wanted to say. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you next time.